My name is Heather Whitener. Um, in June of 1991, I actually was involved in a accident where I dove into the pool and I hit the deep end and the shallow end, the slope, and I hit my head and my chin and I immediately broke my neck. So I am now considered a quadriplegic and I am paralyzed on all four limbs, although I can still use my arms. Um, I have very limited finger use. So I paint with my mouth. I started painting with my mouth when I decided that I was kind of missing something. I was always very imaginative as a child. Um, I'd write stories, I was a reader. Um, I always wanted to be an actress, but that didn't pan out. So um, when I was in college, I would um, do all my assignments with my mouth and write. Well, just as time went on, I started coloring and then I kind of morphed into paint. And before I knew it, I was a full-fledged painter. Art has affected me in many ways. Um, it's given me an outlet, especially with connecting with other people, especially my family members. Um, I've babysat my nieces and nephews since they were little, and they always have known Aunt Heather with a paintbrush in her mouth, and they absolutely enjoy painting with me, and it's really brought us closer. I think that my nieces and nephews have really been impacted by watching me live with a disability. I think in a lot of positive and instrumental ways as they see that I don't give up and that if I can't do something, I'll try and try and try again or try to do it in a different way. Um, I brush my teeth differently, I paint differently. So they see that I do things differently and that I can do it but it's not in the way that the norm does things. So I think in that way, it's been a very positive experience for them. And with my art, it's a great way for us to build on their relationship. I have not always been the greatest artist, let me tell you. I look back at my um, old photo, or all old paintings of like when I was in high school and stuff and uh, I was okay. I always tell people I'm not the best at drawing but for me it's all about color. It's color. Like if I see someone and I want to paint a picture for them for like Christmas or their birthday or just as a good deed, um, I'll think about the person when I paint and lo and behold all the colors that I choose go perfectly with the, their house. So it's almost like I'm connecting with them without them even being here with me. I believe living with a disability is very difficult. I have a lot of limitations and when I paint, all of those limitations go away. I don't want somebody to look at my painting and know that somebody with a disability did it. I want them to look at the opportunities and the possibilities.